So if I want to say the plural, like, fish of the day, say there's multiple fish of the day, is it correct to just say it's the fish of the day and that, that could include multiple fish orders? Does that make sense? Because you wouldn't say the fishes of the day, right? Hmm. He's pondering. He's thinking, I'm pondering. He's thinking. Yeah. Because, like, typically you don't say, like, I believe. Tina? So like I fish believe, of the day it implies one fish. It, well, okay, <laughs> Tina, Tina, what the heck? <laughs> I, I believe fish. Are we talking about multiple different fishes? Yeah. Like if maybe it's tuna a and a salmon. Compare the fish of the day, so, and you are I mean, presented with two options. Is that not confusing? I, I would assume fishes oh of the day would be correct, but I, I yeah. believe fish is Wait. one of those words where both yeah. are acceptable. Uh, because fish is fish is also plural. Like kind of like I deep. believe yeah. fish and fishes are both accepted. What? That's what I, I think. I think it'd be both. Oh my god! Thank you, Ray. Thank you. Oh Wait, god. Ray agreed with me. <laughs> no, Ray agreed with me. <laughs> Ray's in here too. Have you ever heard of the word blue dried? <laughs> what? What are you saying? Ray. Like yes, yes. Okay, Ray, Ludwig, does this sound like a, a correct it's sentence? So, so say, say you're talking about the past tense of drying your hair. You're like, oh, I blew dry. You would never say that ever. No, you blow dry. Blow dry. Why can't you blow dry? Be no, because blow Hear dry yourself. is the word, right? You don't you don't past tense one part of the of the of the joined word. Like, it's not blue. But the type of the type of no. blowing that it was no. in the past tense was a dry one, no. so it's a blue dry. Oh you blew dry. It's the descriptor for what when you dry. You know what I mean? Like I got like, myself um... dry, so I blew dry. No, no, <laughs> no, 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 no. no. First of all, just, first of all, I, just, of all, I mean, just in in terms of pure semantics, it sounds really inappropriate. When you say it. <laughs> right. Who's dry? And second of all, I think we're talking about a oh compound God. word here. You can't just pick. The part of the yeah, compound yeah. word that you want to make past tense. Uh, I don't see why not. Like in my head, like it literally sounds so correct. I blue dry. I blue dry my hair. You, you really uh, think I'm that sounds good? Trying to think good. of a good example. It sounds right in my head. It doesn't sound wrong. I blue dry my hair. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Like, uh, like you know when there's a fire sale? Yeah. No. You wouldn't say, "Oh, there was a fired sale," if 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 like it happened past tense. There was. It it fire sailed. Fire you wouldn't sale. say like fire. You wouldn't past tense just the first part. Well, I agree with that. Well, I guess would you say fire sold though? <laughs> Fuck, oh, that's no. a bad example. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> hmm. But what is a fire? I don't sale? know. Like like literally like just like in my head like just saying like I blew dry sounds right. I blew dry like, my hair. No. I blew dry uh, my hair. I blew dry my hair. I blew okay. Dry okay. My dish hair. dish dishwasher. Dishwasher. Okay. No, that's a bad example too. <laughs> Fuck, it's actually really what? hard. He might be right, guys. Uh, he's right. I'm, I'm losing it. No, 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 no he's wrong. not. My favorite. You would say I blow dried my hair. Blue I'm losing it over here. My my English degree is fraudulent. I cheated so much. You did? You cheated? <laughs> we asked the wrong guy. Oh, Damn it. Just forget forget it. Just freaking forget it. It was a journalism degree that I spun into a double major because that shit was free. All the goddamn credits were like complimentary, so I got an English mm. degree too, but the classes were easy as shit. I took an Eastern European literature class. You think I read Russian novels? God. Yeah. Dorchesky? Oh, I'm not time. smart enough to read Dorchesky. Oh, it's all a lie? He what did Dorchesky write about? His uncle Ivan or some shit? I barely remember. Like, like, I cheated. Like the, like the Rasputin guy? No, different oh. guy. Very beautiful, oh. beautiful writer that I don't know oh. a word of what he wrote. Blue okay. Blue dry. Okay, but you still think that fish if, of the day implies one <laughs> dish that's a fish of, you know, like one species of fish of the day, right? Yes. I'm pretty sure it's chill to say fish and fishes. That's what I think. Here are fishes just... of the day. No, it's just fish. Here are the fish of the day. Here are your options for the fish of the day. Fish oh. of the No, but if they say prepare the fish of the day, that's the when it's confusing. Fish. Which is what Here's the, the thing, here's the thing. Were. You know what the issue here is? The issue here is the. Because the implies a yeah. singular dish. So if you're saying yeah. the fishes of the day, it sounds weird. Not because fishes, 
but because the the that precedes it. Ooh. So you would have to use a different word rather than the. Like we have oh. some fishes of the day no. for you. Okay, okay. I can Tina. I can agree with that much. But I will say that the way they, they just need to change the way it was written. Then very That's misleading confusing. because I was I was shocked when it told me to prepare the fish of the day and I was presented with two options. These fishes of the day. Are you? Does this come from played up? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is a played up uh, argument. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And it went on forever. <laughs> All right. I'll see my way out. Hey, listen. All right. Godspeed. 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 Godspeed.